five, four, three, two, one. Thunderbirds are gone, sadly. Yes, uh, Jerry Anderson, the creator of Thunderbirds, Space 1999, Captain Scarlet, and many more, sadly passed away uh, just after Christmas this year. And, um, well, I decided to try and do something of a tribute to him in Kerbal Space Program. Unfortunately, I am sorely lacking models. I did find this nice, untextured model of Thunderbird 3, which you can, of course, take into space and fly around. It needs a bit of hacking to get working properly, but uh, now, uh, more interestingly, Red Spar Technology has produced this fantastic Space 1999 Moonbase Alpha Eagle. Now, the Eagle was uh, famous from the TV show Space 1999. It was the spacecraft they would fly around from, uh, well, Moonbase Alpha. And <laughs> yeah, it, it is designed for Kerbal Space Program 0.16, so it doesn't have complete support for everything. It doesn't have support for action groups, and you need to hack it to make the uh, capsule actually work as a capsule. But uh, once you do all that, you can get yourself a relatively good spacecraft. Uh, all the bits fit together nicely, and you know, there's even probably some room to, to do some more hacking on it. It has all the features you desire from the TV show. It has the VTOL engines with the correct sound, you'll note. The main engines have the regular engine sound by the sound of things. Um, but yeah, it has enough VTOL power to take off on the moon and fly around and plenty of fuel to do so. Obviously this is before episode 1 of Space 1999 because I'm sure you all remember that the, they have a slight accident with a stockpile of nuclear arms which blows the moon off away from Earth into an interstellar trajectory whereupon they have great adventures uh, which are great adventures <laughs> of an episodic nature as these things go. But yes, um, if you can find it it's, and set it up it's a it's a nice thing to have. You have to manually make sure you get your port and starboard figured out. I think I've got mine figured out, but I'm sure someone will point out that I've got the pods on the wrong side. In which case, um, I apologise for that. Yeah, it, it's got a support for IVA, so you can stick a couple of characters in it. It uses the the internal cockpit texture is the same as the three man pod. Or not, the, mo the model is the same as the three-man three -man pod. Anyway, yeah, um, Jerry Anderson, very important to my childhood, indirectly, produced many, many TV shows. He always really wanted to work with live action, but uh, he ended up working with puppets a lot just so he could get his TV show made. He was supposedly responsible for the creation of Super Mario Nation, where they could automatically move a puppet's lips in time to a tape. But I don't really remember him for the puppets. I really remember him for the, the great special effects and ship designs that he produced on a shoestring budget. Now I feel it's my fatherly duty to make sure the kids watch every episode of Thunderbird, Stingray and Captain Scarlet. Wherever you're going, Jerry, fly safe. <laughs>